And a Baldwin County student with special needs is taking an important step forward. He recently made the transition from an internship to becoming an employee at Thomas Hospital. News 5's Chad Petrie is giving us a look at Project Search, which helps get more young people with special needs into the workforce. Braden Villarreal is seeing his persistence pay off. A very big step into the adult world, I guess you can say. Yeah. It's a little scary. It's always scary, but this program has been very good for me so far, and I'm quite happy with it. He's starting his job at the surgery department at Thomas Hospital after being a part of Project Search, a program aimed at teaching students with special needs the skills they need to be successful in the workforce. I think any school system worth their salt uh, looks at all of their students and develops programs that can assist all students, whether you're highly gifted or whether you're somebody in between, general ed, or whether you're somebody that maybe has, maybe has a few challenges to overcome. And like like Braden, I don't think he considers himself someone really with a disability. Baldwin County's project search has been going on for the last three years, and in that time, they estimate about 30 students with special needs have gotten jobs. We don't necessarily talk about the disability. We talk about all our students' abilities. Everybody has an ability. We just pull that ability out of that student, and we just kind of showcase it. Braden takes this step and hopes others can follow. In Fairhope, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.